Hello everyone, welcome to another week of my vlog. Uh, it's my vlog series. This has been happening four times in a row now. I'm so excited. I wonder if you guys are excited about this video. Maybe some of you guys even look forward to it. Do you? Mm. Tell me. All right, so this week we'll be talking about something really, really interesting. I hope you guys find it as interesting as I do find it. Uh, I'm sure you guys will, okay? Now, a lot of articles have been written about what I'm about to talk to you guys about. A lot of people have made a killing from writing articles that have been posted on the internet about the five types of people to avoid in order to live a healthy life, a stress-free life, a happy life. They say avoid the uninspired, the uninspiring, the unhappy, blah, 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 blah. That's not what I'm talking about. This is Toka Makinwa's own version. This is my own edition, my own rules my own laws it's my blog after all so these are uh, my own five sets of people or five types and kinds of people that you as an individual need to stay clear of all right are you guys ready maybe you need to pull out a piece of paper and a pen and uh let's go on this right so yeah let's go the first set of people are the cereal pingas oh god yes you can afford a blackberry yes you own one you don't need to make my life a living hell you don't need to ping me every single time you want to start a conversation. I totally hate it when people ping me just to start a conversation. Hey, can't you say hi? Can't you say good morning? First thing they do is ping. And some people are the worst. They ping once. They ping another time. They ping like six times. The Blackberry itself does not allow them to ping again. Yes, you know who you are. Give yourself a hug right now. You're one of those people. The second type of people, or the second types of people actually. Let's see. Hmm. This is very interesting. Those I have just the right people. You say hello to a friend you haven't seen in quite a long time, and you're like, oh, hey, how are you? I mean, where have, you know, how are you? How are you? I haven't seen you since. And the next thing is, ah, I just got back from London. I just got back from South Africa. I just got back from Dubai. I totally hate when people do that. Why can't you just shut up? I don't care where you've been. I wasn't looking for you. I'm just trying to say hi. It totally drives me crazy when people do that i'm thinking uh okay all right you just feel the need that i should know where you've been hmm. okay cool the third set of people ah this ones they are totally hopeless and helpless they ask the most stupidest questions ever i use the word stupidest because i am so vicious about this statement the people who call you you answer your phone the first thing they ask you is hey are you awake mm -mm. you're talking to a dead person no no, mm -mm, I'm not awake. Of course I'm awake. Of course I'm on the other end of the phone. If I was not, why would I answer? The fourth set of people are the complainers. I call them the serial complainers. You know, you meet what that one person, maybe you're like, you know, waiting to board a flight and someone is sitting next to you. You totally don't know this person. And they start with you. Ah, oh, this flight is so late. I'm so tired. I've been flying for a week. I've been to Japan, Malaysia, Dubai. Skwansky, Skwansky, countries that have never even been on the map. You know, those kind of people just make me think, wait a minute. So what have you been traveling? Why are you complaining? It's lifestyle. You love it, don't you? The people who say to you, ah, the Dubai mall was so full. First class was annoying me. Everyone there was just annoying. Hmm. The last set of people that I will talk about. Oh my God, this set of people made me forget the last one. How can I? Okay, let's take it from the top. I've spoken to you guys about the serial pingas. I spoke to you guys about people who uh, feel the need to tell you, I just arrived, such people. People that, yes, I just arrived. I spoke to you about people who ask the most stupidest questions and the complainers. And of course, the last set of people, how can I forget? Let me tell you. They are the ones who name drop shamelessly. People who feel the need to tell you who they know, at what point they knew them, since when their relationship started, where they are going. I mean, you're having like tea or lunch with someone and in one conversation alone, they tell you how they met the queen, their phone rings, oh, that's the Sultan of Brunei. Another phone rings, oh, that's the governor of Delta States. Another phone rings, oh, that's Genevieve, she does my hair. You know, people who just feel the need to name drop all of the time. Now, I hope you guys have had enough uh, fun listening to me rant on about the five types of people to avoid. If you don't avoid them, you might have, you know, hypertension at a very young age or you might just be frustrated okay so in order to live a healthy life make sure that you avoid the five types of people that i've mentioned to you and of course you have to subscribe to this channel if you do that you're not avoiding anyone 
all right make sure you follow me on twitter i am at tokstar which is t-o-k-s-t-a-r-r and visit my blog it is www.tokamakiwa.com uh, or you can just type www.tokamakiwa.blogspot.com and until i come your way again next week wednesday make sure you love one another make sure you avoid the five types of people i just told you about and make sure you're not one of them or if you're one just keep yourself a home Goodbye. God bless you. Chat with you guys next week and bye.